Should one of us return to the fortress? No. You know what the plan is. Keep your eyes on that convoy and get ready to spill blood. What is happening here? Down there. One of our own has been captured by Philakitai. Philakitai? You're plotting an ambush? Just waiting for the right moment. We could use an extra sword. Our gratitude goes a long way. <laughs> Ready your blade, Magi. Get ready to move out. You should have killed me. The vermin me. will be on the lookout. Now you die! We have been successful in finding the king's enemy. We go now. Can't I wait to see the king's face when we bring this villain in. Slaughter in every world. last one of these dogs! Think of something special in my suit. Whoa. Uh. I'm going to enjoy Whoa. slashing out some entrails. Release me! I'll wet my blade with their blood! Whoa. Get jumped. Uh, there's nothing here. All right, careful now. You are Bayekasiwa, aren't you? I've heard stories of the Medjai who crossed the desert. I am Theodorus, one of many who rebel against the Philakitai. Is that what landed you in this cage? Yes, a failed attack. I am hunting Doratos, a ruthless general of Ptolemy with a hatred for Egyptians. A killer of mothers, and fathers, and children. I won't rest until his body is food for the worms. Would you lend your sword? Gladly. Your plight is true. Good joy. We will regroup with my men in Bacchus. Come along. How does a Greek find himself fighting an Egyptian cause? My father was Egyptian. My mother, Greek. <laughs> Long ago, a day came when I discharged every ounce of Greek blood from my body and pledged to rid Egypt of men like Deratos. And we nearly did. We found his camp, but they had greater numbers. We were forced to disband. I was captured by a scouting convoy and beaten into giving up our retreat point. But you instead led them into a trap. Clever. I knew my brothers would rescue me. But I did not know the Medjai from Siwa would be among them, too. You are rather celebrated amongst my group. Whoa. We spent years tracking Rujik. Only to learn, you made waste of him single-handedly. We will take shelter here, and wait for the right moment to strike. Whoa. Nick Ennis. 
Perhaps you would not call us your ally. But our goals seem to be aligned from time to time, don't they? You are not incorrect. I will get briefed. <clears throat> Don't know about you, but something is watching. You hear something? Hey, what's the meaning of this? Idiot! <clears throat> Game on you! <laughs> <laughs> Here. Aha, uh, so red dot? We will take shelter here and wait for the right moment to strike. I will get briefed. Dogs! They've sent out scouting groups. Theodoros! Theratos has left the camp. He's gone! Come along! Theratos is gone. Neck! He continues to elude me. What should we do? Let's be smart. We have an opportunity to claim two victories with one swift strike. We need to wait for Doratos to return to camp. I've learned his personal scribe has stayed behind in Karanis. We'll be targeted if we so much as take a piece nearby. You are unknown to them. Bring the scribe to us. He'll tell us what we need to know. How do I find him? At night, he rests within the courtyard. During the day, you can find him working around the temple, or at the terrace overlooking the lake. He dresses elegantly, and due to our failed attack, now has guards in tow. He'll be hard to miss. The scribe is the key to learning Doratos' schedule. Go to Karanis, and bring him to us. Bring the scribe here. We will take care of the rest. What's the matter with Simba Owl? Her for what? Sure, not a deal. Ciao! Hurry! We do have a nick in his sitchin? Do have more as far as the Vazma that do that is. Must you follow me around everywhere? Strict orders from the general. We are not to leave your side. He's overreacting. I am safe here. The Ratos won't take any chances. The rebels could strike again. We are all on high alert. It won't be long before he comes to. I need to bring him back to Theodorus. Hey, 
regole! E sprati! That is him. Well done. We will find out what he knows. In the meantime, we must prepare our attack. Some of our brothers are stationed just west of Soknopayo. Meet with them and wait for my arrival. We will put an end to that Nekatirdet. A scribe who knows his way around Karanis. Deratos, where is he? That name means nothing to me. Don't think us fools! Please, stop! Then talk! We'll break your fingers! No! Then your wrists! No, wrist. don't! Where is Deratos? <laughs> talk! Meet the others and wait for my arrival. Your work here is done. I we will can't. get the information we need. You can find the other rebels just west of Soknopayo. I think a little bit of rain that fell might just be enough. Are you Theodorus's men? Yes. And who are you? He is the Siwan. I come on his behalf. You'll be joining us shortly with instructions. Good. The soldiers are reeling, but it won't be long before reinforcements arrive. Come. Theodorus! Ready your blades and check your arrows. The Rathos will be back at the camp before sunrise. You're with me, but don't forget, he is mine. What is your stake in this? This is more about him than it is about your war. My father grew figs in the Fayum. The best. Teratos taxed him. An Egyptian has no choice but to pay. One season, the harvest was so poor that my father struggled to give his cut. Teratos figured him for a cheat. He took a bite of fruit to prove his point. He got a mouthful of worms. His men laughed. But Teratos was furious. I watched as my father was hanged from his own tree and picked at by every animal in the region. Taratos embodies the unjust. He is why I am who I am. I need you, Bayek. Tririm! The gods have brought us together for this! Justice will be served today! <laughs> For Egypt! For your father, Theodorus! Deratos dies today! Leave no one alive! Clear the camp!
die, you Greek puppet! Let's have a closer look. until all are dead. Remember now, huh? May the field of reeds elude you always. has fallen. Finally, my father's car is at peace. Let's move. We have a long trek ahead. One more villain in Nidat. You have had your vengeance, Theodorus. Was it worth it? <laughs> I was wondering the same. I have not visited my father's tomb since he was killed by Doratos. I had to do right by him. And now, I have. Thank you, Bayek. Shame there are so few Medjai left. Your reputation precedes you. Save your blessings. There will be more battles to win. Yes! May our victories multiply! Come visit us in our hideout. I'm sure we could find some more use for you. I will tell the rebels about this day. Thank you, Bayek. Now... I share a story with you, Medjai. It's finally over. We did it. I'm glad I survived long enough to see this day. Theratos was a terror on this area. And Theodorus experienced it firsthand. My only regret is that we didn't snuff out this bastard sooner. <laughs>
And here I am, at last, in the Fayum. I will root out the agents of the Crocodile. Military presence throughout the Fayum has made life safer for everyone. Egyptian slums are being torn down, rebuilt, or segregated. Greek settlement is more secure than ever. Security for all! Culture for all! Greek and Egyptian knowledge joins in a new climate of restoration. The Fayum is being raised above its humble beginnings. Guided by the principles of Greek civilization, Greece and Egypt live together in peace. Culture for all. Prosperity for all. With increased acquisition of Egyptian land and the use of Greek farming methods, farms in the Fayum now have more success than ever. Prosperity for all. Latest census figures show increased wealth for all in Fayum. Thanks to the great Ptolemy's aid for Greek investors, profits have continued to multiply. Trade activity has increased tremendously, creating substantial economic growth for Greek business throughout the Fayum. Prosperity for all. The new Fayum promises peace and plenty. A new age of wealth under the guidance of Greek innovation. Prosperity for all. Prosperity for all! With increased acquisition of Egyptian land and the use of Greek farming methods, farms in the Fayum now have more success than ever. Security for all! An increased military presence throughout the Fayum has made life safer for everyone. It seems I'm not the first visitor today. Culture for all! Greek and Egyptian knowledge... Hold in a new climate Nick is not here. I need to find out where my informant is. Mm, a lot of damage, but no blood or signs of a fight. Maybe he fled before this happened. Mm. These scrolls tell me nothing useful. I should check upstairs. Ah, who would have done such a thing? What were you protecting, boy? Child's doll. Oh, I'm gonna kill this neck at the other crocodile. Scrolls and ink. Ah, I think that tells me where Hotefres has gone. Wait, feathers. From a messenger pigeon. A letter left behind by my informant. It looks like he fled, but the soldiers caught his servant. If the servant is still alive, he'll know where Hotifres is. They'll be holding him at the nearby military camp. Whoa. 
Guards here are vigilant. What's the story with the beat-up Egyptian? By the captain's tent. He looks half dead. He's the servant of the Greek we're looking for. The captain persuaded him to give up his master's location. He's not done yet, either. He'll eventually tell him everything else he knows. I'll do everything I know. Who are you? A friend. Hold still and stay quiet. I will get you out of here. Gods, thank you. Did Hotefre send you? No, but I must find him. I need his help to find the crocodile. Will you help me? Hotefre took a trader ship to Lake Moeris. It has a large statue on board and is marked by our symbol. The crocodile has hired mercenaries to find him. Then I must hurry. Get somewhere safe. Be well. So, now they send a son of Egypt against me. It has been a long time since I spilled so much blood. I was sent by Apollodorus. Uh, we share a common interest. Who are you? And what do you want, eh? I'm Bayek Siwa, and I seek information on the crocodile. The phantom that has brought Fayum to its knees. What could you want with him? He belongs to a group that is destroying Egypt. I intend to hunt every last one of them down. Bayek of Siwa. You don't know what you are up against. The crocodile has transformed not only the land, but the people. Those who do not cower in fear are made to work for him. And you have no idea who the crocodile is? I stole a ledger from a Greek magistrate I suspect of corruption. It should reveal the identity of this crocodile. And if we get it to Apollodorus, we may be able to bring down the whole organization. Where's the ledger now? I gave it to my wife Henut to hide. As long as the Ptolemies think it's with me, my family is safe. That is why I have to stay on the move. Here. This will tell Henut you are a friend to be trusted. It is for my daughter, Shadia. Once you have the ledger, find me at the docks south of Euhemeria. Bayek, take a look around my ship before you go. I keep records of local problems which may have the crocodile at their root. They may interest you, as a Magi. Entire villages of people have disappeared into Senharis. There are rumors at the caravanserai that demons have invaded. Demons? I have never seen one. I should check this out. <laughs> I am sorry, 
My daughter heard the rumors of demons. She has a vivid imagination. Who is this shrine dedicated to? I am praying for the people killed by fires in Dionysius. Someone is burning down their farms. You, Magi, could help to stop it. I will try to help. What are you doing? A mysterious plague has struck the poor in Uhemeria. Their bodies are being burned, cursing their souls for eternity. They will never reach the field of reeds. I am trying to find a cure for them. There is always a cure. I just need the right combination. Burning the dead? What madness is this? We need to clean this place up and get it running again. Don't worry. I won't let them close down this kitchen. Henut? Yes? Hotefre sent me. I am here to help. And I have your daughter's doll. Great. I was awaiting word from my man. Thank you. Come, eat and we can talk. I love my new doll, Bayek. I will name her Iset, and she will be the protector of all Fayum. Ever since Hotefres got a hold of that ledger, Fayum has been on edge. Soldiers with torches patrol every night, and this aunt's kitchen was practically razed to the ground. They have left Shadia and me alone at least. Hotefres has made sure of that. Where is the ledger now? I instructed our most loyal servant to hide it in our villa. They can search the place as many times as they want. They will never find it. Can you take me there? I have been summoned to the lighthouse for another of their routine investigations. Ah, that may not be safe. The Ptolemaic authorities seem to be working with the crocodile. It happens every few days. Don't worry. They wouldn't dare touch someone in an official position. Shadia. Show Bayek the way to our home. Come on, Uncle Bayek! You can see my house from that roof! Follow me! You are not afraid of heights, are you? <laughs> hey, lead on, little one! I will follow. <laughs> Where did you learn to climb like that? That looks like fun. <laughs> I come up here a lot. Everything looks so beautiful. The people should be happy, but they are not. Don't worry. Your mother and father will look after them. Where is your house? On the hill there. See it? Yes. And soldiers. Thank you, Shadia. You should go back to your mother now. It might get dangerous. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. Iset can fight, you know. She will protect me. La la la, la la la, la 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 la. Bye, Shadia. You and Iset enjoy your life. This area is off limits. Huh? <laughs> 
Maps of settlements in the Fayum. Part of Henot's work. Interesting, but not what I'm looking for. Did we find the ledger? <clears throat> not yet, but it won't be long. The captain is upstairs questioning the servant. Stupid Egyptian flacos. Henut is a marked woman. Loyalty to her will get them killed. Complaints to Alexandria about the administration's practices in Fayum. From Henut. She didn't have much success. No ledger. Something blocking it on the other side. There must be another way in. Another of Shadia's dolls. Did Hotofles make this one too? An unfinished letter to the Sobek priests. Scathing. Henut and the cult don't see eye to eye. Nothing else here. Savants try to barricade the doors. They weren't quick enough. Gods! Shadia wrote this. She has the ledger. And I sent her back to her mother. I have to find Henut before the soldiers get to her. Oh, Shadia. What have you done, little one? You cannot play games with the crocodile. Heresy, yes, she did. William. Not a heruye. Big soup air. Whoa. Have you seen Hernut? Is she here? The soldiers just came and took her to the lighthouse. Young Shadia too. Henot argued with them, but they would not listen. Something is wrong, isn't it? This has never happened before. Get word to Hotefres. Hurry! Damn all this! Henot and Shadia are at the lighthouse. I need to get there now! Neck! Neck! What have we done? Gods, what have we done? Easy, brother. The crocodile did this. Not you or me. Surely it must have been necessary. Say that when the nightmares come. We watched and did nothing. We are not innocent. <laughs> Ah! 
I didn't imagine it. Uh, hey! Hold on, you! Alt! Hold there! I should be cautious around here. Wait a minute. Wait a second. It is over. The crocodile has won. The ledger lost. My daughter. My Shadia. He has taken everything from us. He will pay for this. And all those who serve him. None of that will bring Shadia back. No. But at least you'll have the comfort of revenge. We both will. I hope so. I will do anything I can to help you, brother. Has he not been able to tell you anything? Only that there were other men with the soldiers. 
Large, imposing warriors. One red-haired. Bandits? Soldiers? I believe they were gladiators from the arena in Crocodilopolis. It seems this... this monster uses fighters to do his bidding. I will find this monster, friend. He will die. of the road. Whoa. All of Paranis is being rebuilt according to a grand master plan. The ugly Egyptian slums are being torn down, replaced by stately Greek temples. Culture for all. We are leading the Fayum, the very heart of Egypt, into a new and glorious age. This is our shared destiny. A stronger Fayum, a fairer Fayum, a Fayum full of culture and knowledge. The old gives way to the new under the mighty hand of Serapis. Serapis, a god Greek and Egyptian alike, called their own. Together, we will create a new culture, culture for all. Under the watchful gaze of the nomarch himself, all of Karanis is being rebuilt according to a grand master plan. Oh! 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 Ah, Bill! Keep back! This doesn't concern any of you. Carry on with whatever it is you do. Another murder. Amun. How horrible. It's the young priest from the temple. God save us. Who will be next? No one is safe. It is this cursed temple. I told you. It is a blasphemy. The gods are angry. Move back. Back. Are you the Philakitai? Yes. Try not to trample the scene. My job is hard enough as it is. Oh, my apologies. As a protector, I am attracted to such sins. A fellow protector? Ah, yes, I see your badge. You are a Magi. From the old kingdom? Wow. Forgive me, this gruesome business has us all on edge. Huh? This is the latest in a series of chilling ritual murders by uh, Wajet cultists. To be honest, I'm a little out of my depth. I may be of some use to you. I am not unfamiliar with murder sins. Perhaps you could help investigate. The cultists usually leave a message. I haven't figured it out yet. We could check the temple. You said there have been other murders. The cultists are murdering temple acolytes, public figures in Karanis. No one knows why. Anyone could be their next target. The Greeks are terrified. They're saying locals are involved and are calling for blood. The timing is inconvenient. Years of work building over the poorly constructed Egyptian temple. 
Endless delays and problems. Now this. There is a lot of pressure to solve this. But please, take your time. Enjoy the temple. This is a lot of blood. Someone was bound and tortured here, in front of the statue. By the signs, they were cut up badly, then dragged outside. It must have been the poor acolyte. There was no one else here. Why did they do this? A Greek god where an Egyptian god once stood. This would make some in Egypt very angry. Someone has smeared the god with green paint. The head has also been covered. Wait. Something else is up there. Serapis' oh. <clears throat> face is hidden and defaced with more green paint. A green mask of Wajet has been placed here. Wajet is goddess protector of Upper and Lower Egypt. Someone is making a clear statement. But how did they get up here carrying all of this? This is written in blood. It is still wet. The murderers are going to kill the high priest next. We have to find him. The Philakitai should know where he is. Philakitai, I found the cultist message. They're going to kill your high priest next. The high priest? By Serapis, no. Karani's spirit will die if he does. We need to find him. Where is he? Think, Philakitai! His villa is nearby. I know of a spot overlooking it from a safe distance. This way. We can see the whole area from the temple wall. Your temple is the reason for this trouble. It is a bitterness for the locals. That's absurd. It has increased industry and trade. Everyone has benefited. Your dead acolyte and high priest may not agree. Gods, the trouble I'll get if the high priest lies dead. We must hurry. Simba out. <laughs> what? That's the High Priest! Those men have him surrounded! You must help him! Quickly! Get to the main entrance and act when I do! Yes, uh... Or I could stay up here as lookout! I'll warn if more bandits approach! You go! <clears throat> Oi! It is maze on us! Watch it! Accept the blood of this blasphemer! Give us power to defeat the Greek devils. This is madness. You gain nothing by killing me. Greece and Egypt grow together. Our gods do not fight. Why do we? Hypocrite and blasphemer. You defiled our temple. Replaced our gods with your own. Your life is forfeit. <laughs> going to sacrifice me. You are safe now. It is fortunate you are not at the temple. You would already be dead. Serapis! They would have butchered me! These Egyptians are prayerless demons and not men! It was an Egyptian who saved you, priest. Remember that when you pray and give thanks. We Medjai protect all, regardless of their class. I came as soon as the fighting began. I see I am too late. Thank you for your help, Magi. It certainly made my work here easier. 
You have interesting timing. What do you know of these bandits? Egyptians unhappy with the Greeks here. Who knows what holes they crawl from? Seeing a Greek god in place of their own incensed them, no doubt. Understandably. You have not seen the last of such trouble, I think. The Ptolemies tend to divide us at times. Sadly, I agree. Greece has brought Egypt much wealth, yet some resist all progress. This depends on your idea of progress. Progress for Egypt or for Greece. Farewell, Philakitai. Next time you protect, remember my code. Any suggest yet? Neb, I must speak with you. I saw you with the Falaketai of Karanese. Are you a protector? I am. Is there something wrong? Please, we need your help. Yesterday my husband witnessed something frightening. Soldiers dragged a poor man beneath the temple. Then he heard screams. We're already hungry because there's no grain. Now I'm terrified the soldiers will take my husband. We don't know who we can trust. Not even the Philakitai. Let me talk to your husband. Where can I find him? He's a stone mason working near the temple. Please be careful. The soldiers mustn't see you talk to him. Stone Mason, your wife has been to see me. Shh! How did you get up here? By a moon, that woman interferes. I told her. What can we do? Just act normal. Yeah, that's it. Stay normal. Calm yourself. She said you saw soldiers take someone below the temple. Yes. No! Yes. Okay, it's true. It wasn't the first time, but yesterday was different. There were screams that would wake the gods themselves. So many screams. Now please, just leave me alone before someone sees you. Just act normal. <laughs> What? Here again? No, please go! Someone will see you! Uh, some people just should not whistle. No. This looks like the place the stonemason told me about. Moon. What has been done here? <laughs> uh. 
That is a lot of grain when most people do not have enough. Hmm, this looks like a temporary storage area. Are they moving grain? Blood. And a lot of it. That must explain the screams. Someone called the Butcher is strong-arming farmers. I need to find him. I should follow this trail of loot. A bathing sobek. Bathing? Must be in water. A sobek in water. Hmm. There's a Sobek ruin not far from here. The butcher's loot could be nearby. Whoa. <clears throat> Those are guards. This must be the place. The bathing Sobek should be close. is heavily guarded. I've never taken a man's arm before. Did you see how clean the cut was? Right through the bone. That's talent. <laughs> God, did he scream. Not one farmer will have the guts to resist now. If they knew the butcher, they wouldn't even consider it. He was lucky it wasn't his head. Few cross the butcher and live. We shouldn't even be talking of it. If word could back to him, we'd get in trouble. statue in the lake. That must be the bathing Sobek from the butcher's letter.
There is an engraving on the chest depicting Soknopayu. That is a village west of here. The coins are in bags normally used to store grain. Did this come from a storehouse? of guards for a simple storehouse. This must be the place. I have to get past them if I want answers. This place is heavily guarded. The butcher will be nearby. What are these goons hiding? I hear they took his arm at the butcher's order. I guess we are common thugs now, not soldiers. Shh! Keep your voice down. Kamoto! This is not what I joined the army for. It is what puts grain on your table. You are here now. When the butcher says jump, we jump! That is how it is. Now shut up before someone hears us. This is where they are hiding all the grain. Taken straight from the tables of Fayum families. Damn this greedy naked yadet. I should look around. Wait a minute. are starving while the rich fill their storehouses. This has to stop. I should keep looking around. Ledger entries showing payments for grain. Huh. The butcher is not paying the farmers even enough to live. I need to find information on where he is. Ah, this is it. The butcher is in the villa nearby. It is time this butcher and I had a talk. <laughs> a palatial villa. Built on the backs of Fayum's farmers, no doubt. Do your job. That brain is what pays for your 
beer and women? Or did you think they like you because you're a soldier? Ah, here's the Vlaka who's been messing with my business. We were just discussing you. You've been stealing grain from Fayum, starving people for profit. You're not from Fayum, are you? Your speech reeks of the countryside. That grain belongs on Egyptian tables. You naive backwater Malakia. I take orders from above. If not me, someone else will do this. This is business. People pay what they owe, or I take it. It's not personal. I give you a choice now. Leave me alone and live, or die here. Others thought the way that you do. Then they murdered my son. Everything is personal. You filthy Nekatiadet! It ends here. Guard, take care of this. May the Hidden One greet you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. Everyone, b -b 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 be careful! The c c c curse of Wajet! Snakes! N n n n near the v v v v villa at n night! F fellow c c c c c Greeks, stay in your homes after the dark. We have lost our her her money, and an Egyptian c c c c curse is upon us! Snakes from the Egyptian serpent g -g 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 goddess. I've seen them with my, 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 my own eyes. What curse? What are you talking about? G -g 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 Greeks and Egyptians have lost harmony with each other. The g -g gods are displeased because of it. I'm Nanefer, and I don't know if I'm g -g 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 Greek or Egyptian. I'm an Orphan. Lost harmony? What do you mean? The Egyptian g -g goddess Wajed is sending snakes into g -g Greek quarters at night. Only g -g Greeks have been killed. We are out of b -b -b balance. See for yourself. Just n n north of the villa. Okay. I will look into this curse. That was harder than it should have been. Oh, 
Neck. What was that? The gods are rumbling. It came from just north of here. Must have something to do with this curse. What happened here? I should ask around. This man was pinned down and died in the blaze. The structure is badly damaged. I cannot go any further. The trail leads outwards. I should look around the courtyard. <clears throat> ah, I can smell the burnt flesh. This jar does not belong here. I think there is movement inside. <laughs> ah, a snake! The jars have been used to transport them. Neb, did you see what happened? It was the curse of Wajet. A fool and his friends feasted at the Dromos. I told him, this is a sacred place. We cannot eat here. What did he expect would happen? And you believe in this curse? You Egyptians have your gods. We Greeks have ours. All I know is, I don't want to anger any of them. Another foreigner cursed by Wajet. That is three this week. Those useless Greeks had it coming, if you ask me. But what do I know? I am just the lowly Egyptian caretaker who cleans up after the naked Yadit. Hey, be careful what you say. People have died. I need to look around. What you need to look at is the color of your skin, son. Harmony is what we need. Not more senseless judgment. Look, some of us have built a shrine in a cave under what is left of the Great Temple. Why don't you come and honor Wajet with us? Egyptians have to stick together. Maybe I will, after I look around. These jars are the same as the ones I saw in the Greek area. They are breeding the snakes here. Gods, I hate snakes. Ah, snakes again. Why did it have to be snakes? An elaborate shrine to the serpent goddess Wadjet. sound of it, you will not have to find the caretaker after all. He has already found me. Hey, 
Caretaker, the snakes were yours. You serve Greeks? Come on then, you worthless Ionian slave. Do your master's bidding like a good Greek dog. I fight for Egypt. Who do you fight for? I serve no one, and I fight for everyone. This is what Ptolemy has done to Egypt. A land out of balance, full of hatred and strife. At least I can rescue the hostage. He's being held by the caretaker's men at Panuki. The caretaker is using the goddess to kill Greeks. Why such hatred? Aya would be sad. It is just as Nanifer warned through his stutter. Egypt has lost harmony. Caretaker's handiwork. These unfortunate Greeks were in the wrong place at the wrong time. The caretaker's hideout must be up ahead. I should be cautious around here. Ah! The smell of rotting flesh. What is going to happen to that stupid stuttering creek inside? He's going to be sacrificed to Wadjet when the caretaker gets here. Blood sacrifice? The priest stopped that years ago. Our ancestors followed the true path before it was corrupted by false teaching. That's why Wajit abandoned us to the bastard Greeks. Well, at least he won't escape. You beat him so badly, he's lying in his own blood. <laughs> he can't even stand. <laughs> Stupid Greek! He had it coming. He hasn't even started to bleed yet. Wait till the caretaker gets to him. The body looks to be a Greek. It has been here a while. That explains the smell. He was struck down from behind. Another of the green wadjet masks. Gifts from the caretaker to his men. Ugh! <laughs> 
the shrine to the snake goddess Wajit. Can you stand? Thank Sarah, is you're here. I d d d d don't think so. They b b b b beat me. Be still. I will carry you out. They beat me. They beat me because they thought I'm Greek. Wait. What happened to your stutter? I was scared when I first met you. It makes me stutter. By the gods, is nothing true. Well, you are alive, Nanifa. Be thankful. I'm alive, but Egypt is out of balance. You must know, Magi, the law is harmony between all peoples. May Serapis unite us all. That is the end of the caretaker's cult. But Nanifer is right. Egypt is out of balance. And that is the order of ancients doing. All the blood has been washed away, but some green paint remains. Uh, perhaps it is fitting. Some things should not be forgotten. Idiotin! Uh.
Manieren gaan taraksen. That young woman is standing right on the edge of the cliff. I should check on her. or I'll jump. You aren't the first person to try and persuade me. Easy. That is a long way down, even for me. It doesn't matter. Nothing matters anymore. A scorpion took my husband's life. There's nothing left for me now. You could find the scorpion that killed him and kill it. <laughs> Are you mocking me or trying to be cruel? Hey, even bitter laughter is better than death. Hey, why don't you step away from the ledge, huh? We can talk. I don't know what to say. Tell me of your husband. We used to come up here to watch the herons. Two of them built a nest together in that tree. We watched them bring fish for their young. We dreamed of our own children. And you are sad because you did not have any. You're not very good at this, Magi. You're not making me feel any better. There is no way to make you feel better. There's only tomorrow, and then the next day, one moment at a time. What you say is true. I just don't think I can face it. I want to show you something. I will return soon. Hey, try not to jump. There were some herons nearby, down by that tree. I've got what I need. I should give the feather to the girl. Careful, it's steep. Now you are worrying about heights? I've got something for you. This is for you. A heron feather? Why? It is a C1 ritual. Feathers mean a lot to us. Anubis will weigh all our hearts when we die. Against my art's white feather. Yours. Mine. Our loved ones. I know what you're doing. This feather is for my afterlife. Your husband will meet you in the field of reeds when it is time. But it is not a place to rush to. He would want you to live now and be happy. Yes, you're right. He would. I should thank you for this gift. You can thank me by showing me the way down. All right, Magi, you win. This way. I'm sorry. I must seem childish to you. Ah, believe me. No. I understand your grief. That's why you knew what to say, isn't it? Did you lose someone too? Many have lost loved ones to the Ptolemies. Does it get better? It gets better. But you will never be the same. Yes, I already know that. What is your name? I am Tua'a. I am not from here. I come from Crocodilopolis. I am Baek, from Siwa. What are you doing in Soknopayo Nessos? You're from Siwa? I can tell. You're so nice. Your people are kind. I didn't want to waste my life sewing and weaving for my father. Then, I met my husband and we eloped. 
We didn't have much, but we were happy here. You could return to your family. They will miss you. You could be happy again. I can't go back to sewing carpets. Besides, my father will never look me in the face again. Few fathers would turn away the child they thought they had lost. Leopards! Bayek! Stay back. Sobek! I thought we were dead! Are you hurt? No, but that was terrifying. Death isn't so desirable when you really see it. I guess I do want to live. <laughs> now she wants to live. <laughs> hey, that is good. But we should move before hyenas come for the carcasses. Could you take me to the docks? You have decided where to go then? I'll find that scorpion that killed my husband. <laughs> No, I think I know what to do. I'll head south, maybe even back to Kropodilopolis. I've always wanted to work at the theater. This place has too many memories for me. Do not forget your family. Your father will miss you, whatever you think. Here we are. Will you be okay? Thank you, Bayek. I will keep this feather and weigh it against my heart. Go do your hero work. Be safe, Dua'a. Go save the world, Magi. Just as the praying man said, this farm was torched as if by Ra himself. A man is coming. He is armed. What should we do? I am armed too. We are not in any danger. Be calm. My name is Bayek. A protector. A protector? We could use one. Talk to my lady. I am Bayek. A Medjai. A real Magi. Not a Philakitai, I hope. <laughs> I'm Zahra. This was my farm. Who burned it down? Hordes. The naked Iadets trying to drive us out. They are lucky I wasn't here. I would have spread their guts across my fields. I am going to warn my Greek neighbor. His farm might be next. Please join me. I will follow you, Zahra. We have to protect this land. Yes, it is rich and fertile and worth fighting over, like me. This farm isn't far from here. See if you can keep up, Magi. What brings you to the Fayum? We get few visitors this way. Magi especially. Whoa. I am... hunting murderers. You came to the right place. Full of dogs worth killing. The Fayum is not the oasis it once was. How long have your farms been getting burned? Since the dawn of the new Ptolemy, most of the farmers, they could not fight back and got pushed out. My family was amongst those who fought. The struggle became our way of life. I fought so much I forgot to fall in love. I am a romantic though. My father wanted me to marry and give him lots of grandchildren. Gods! Me with a bunch of screaming kids? Our land needed protection, so I learned to fight. Egypt needs fighters. 
It was a good decision. Turns out I am apt at shit kicking. A warrior farmer. You must have stories. So many. We should swap tales around the fire sometime. With your help, maybe I'll have time to fall in love. I do not suppose your Greek neighbor is harboring these fire bandits. That would make things simpler. But no, those are definitely uninvited guests. Keep a safe distance. I'm going to... Nick, no. You are not. You keep a safe distance. I will be amidst the blood splatter. <laughs> a farmer warrior with a duat wish. Fine. Let us dance together. Damn these wretched cowards. Focus. We don't want any widows on our end to get. Won't survive an encounter with me. <gasps> you have been looking for us. We know. We thought we would save you time and come to you. We are here to help. When we bring you to the fire, you will understand. You will be purified. The flames will release your pain. You will all burn away. The son of Ra will set you free. I don't think so. The bindings were so tight I can't feel my legs. Get me out of here before more bandits come. Beyond. What a mess. I will carry you. Let's go. <sighs> You're heavier than you look. Maybe you would like me to carry him. Zakra, that was frightening. Nek! Beyond, we cannot live scared. You must fight back. You truly are a gift from the god, Zakra. I tell all my Greek friends of Zakra, the warrior farmer. We need to find the bandit's nest. I might know where it is. Servants track riders coming south from the White Desert. There is nothing out that way except some ruins. And they mention the name Son of Ra. I think he is their leader. Son of Ra? He will soon be the son of nothing. Into the desert we go, Bayek. Bayek, we need to get moving. It's a long damned way. Okay, let's get there. Gods, by Anubis, I love the desert. It awes me, it always has. I cried like a little girl the first time I came here. I didn't know why. My father told me I was being silly. The desert brings out different sides to us. Yes, it gets cold at night. A fighter like you must have a few farmers interested. Have you never wanted a family of your own? You do not have anyone in mind. I fight too much. Well, maybe a Magi warrior could change that. <laughs> That's an invitation. That looks like ruins up ahead.
Found it. Whoa. Ah. You know the son of Ra is crazy, right? Why? Because he's not like everyone else. He opened our eyes. He never lied to us. He doesn't even take anything from the farm. But they have caught him now. The son of Ra will never give up. And neither should we. Don't you know what happened to him? His family? They burned his farm for no reason. He watched his family die. Which is why he hates farmers more than he hates soldiers. They all just stood back and watched. Well, they will burn too. One by one. But they are going to execute him now. What do we do? He already told us this would happen. We know what to do. This is insanity. They killed themselves in honor of their leader. Old mementos and trinkets. These look personal. All of them are marked by fire. <laughs> Oil, and lots of it. This is how they are starting the fires. This was not their leader. The son of Ra, their real leader, has been giving orders from prison. He's being held by soldiers at a nearby caravansarai. He has been ordering the burnings. He thinks he's a god and invincible. Then we'll make the naked ear dead bleed and prove him wrong. Zahra, do not argue with me about this. I have to do this next task alone. Stop saying that camel shit. I'm not waiting around while you do the fighting. Look, it is cleaner this way. It will be easier for me to get in alone. All right. Have it your way. I'll be nearby.
You! Stop! I should be cautious around here. Position get it. Mound of dirt. Now I rise from the buried earth. That crazy is not right in the head. Did you see his eyes? Do you think he's really the son of Ra? He is a dangerous little madman. But he has got his own private army. They do whatever he says. I'm more scared of what they will do next. Uh, somehow he's still communicating with them. Could a normal man do that? If he is a god, a cage won't stop him. Is he even still there? I just finished my rounds. He's there. The captain wants him executed, but someone higher up is protecting him. Then, we'll have to get his followers before they get us.
You die easily for a god! I am nobody. Nobody. But when the son of Ra stands on the mountain and says, Do it! It gets done. Next! You told them to murder! I am not sorry. Is Bayak Siwa sorry? I lost my family. You lost your family. We have the right to do anything we want to anyone. No! We are different. You burnt farms. You killed innocents. You're insane! Hypocrite! Yeah! You can pile up 1,000 dead bodies in front of me. It doesn't change me. The world will burn. The Order won't save it. You will burn with it, Magi. May you walk the land of the Duat. He is dead. I should tell Zahra. Son of Ra is dead. It was disturbing. His madness almost made sense. If you stare deeply enough into any madness, there is a logic. So what now? The fires are stopped. Your farms are safe. I don't know. I am hungry, though. Now we return to the farm to feast in peace. Is that an invitation? <laughs> you are the Magi. You figure it out. My gate is open and my fruit is sweet. Zahra, how are you? Baik, I missed you. I have not stopped telling stories about the Magi from Siwa. <laughs> Funny. I have not stopped dreaming of Zahra, the warrior farmer. The hero who saved Dionysius from the son of Ra. <laughs> I'm glad I've entered your dreams. That is where I belong. Did you ever get that feast you wanted? Of course I did. Yet still no Magi to share it with. The gods have returned to our farms, Baig. Have you returned to feast with me? <laughs> hey, you are the hero. You figure it out. Here are vigilant. Don't. Hey, wait! Worms, uh, take you! A night, beard, and bear. Get 
I saw the beasts with my own eyes. Demons, twenty hands tall with cruel forked tongues and black skin. Their eyes burned me. Minons of Set, you cannot stop them. They will be here soon. They are coming. They are coming. <laughs> what god can save us from demons? We are lost! There's nowhere to hide! They see us! They know where we are! <sighs> I escaped Anubis. I looked the demons in their black and burning eyes. Then the gods danced me from my shackles! <laughs> Everyone is gone. The monsters took them while we farmed. Gods, save us! What happened to you? We were all attacked by demons. They took the boy. What boy? Why didn't anyone stop them? I tried. I am just a farmer, no warrior. The boy was mad. He thought he could fight the demons. He is just a boy at the Broken Tower. I run away. I... I'm... <laughs> A ruined tower. I cannot leave the boy alone in the desert. I must find him. I escaped Anubis. be the ruined tower the madman spoke about. Not all of his story was insanity then. doing out here alone my business is my own why is a protector coming here there are rumors of disappearing villagers demons and a missing boy our village did not disappear we were taken by bandits I am the only one left but I am going back to save my father if you go into the desert alone you will die then I die I can do nothing else you are brave but foolish a son's duty to his father is to live. I cannot let you go alone. Come if you want to. My duty is to save my father. You are just a boy, but you have the conviction of a man. Your father would be proud. We have to hurry. The desert will take us if the hyenas do not find us first. Follow me. Your father! Are you certain he lives? No. But I have to try. My mother passed many floods ago. I do not remember her. My father raised me alone. I have to return his horse to him. Alive or dead, he will need it in the afterlife. Sandstorm! We must face it straight on! I don't have the time to wait. If he lives, I will save him. If he does not, I will honor him with my death. 
and we will ride through the field of reeds together. Whoa. Time for this. We have to keep going. Boy, you must stay here. The way forward is dangerous. I will do everything in my power to rescue your father. Saving my father is my duty, not yours. I am not a boy. I am Rahotep of Dionysios, and I am going. I am Bayek of Siwa, and I will not take you into danger. You are not taking me. I am taking myself. Ah, damn you, Rahotep. Should have tied you to a tree. You have only just met me, yet I have answered all your questions truthfully. I am going to save my father. You have no duty here. You cannot forbid me anything. I am not your son. You are not the only one with a duty. I am a Magi, and my duty is to protect. Magi? There are none of you left. Just Philakes, you sack our villages and kill our mothers. Protectors are corrupt. We need new Magi. New protectors. We need people and Magi to be as one, Rahotep. I don't see it. Is the goddess the answer? Cleopatra? I cannot say for certain. But someone has to do what the Magi did. Honor and Egypt are both dying. I will have children and teach them, so that honor will live on in them. Here. Stay low. We're near the bandit camp. Their guards can see us. Rahotep, my son was like you. He also fought a man's battle, and died doing it. Would you stay hidden? All right, Bayek. I will listen to you in this. But if you fall, I will take your place. See the lookout tower there? The guards from time to time abandon their post to piss. We can pass through then. You have an eye for strategy. Your father should be proud. Now keep to the shadows and wait. attack on site here.
Villagers, let's go. We need to leave this area. Quickly, this way. They left horses over here. Hurry, let's go! You are alive! Is everyone okay? Where is my father? Rahotep, I'm sorry. The demons took him to the crocodile pit. How can anyone fight them? Demons do not bleed as these do. Listen to me. Each of you owes your life to my father. Turo! Remember he took a lashing to protect your daughter's honor? And you! Remember he crossed the desert to get your sick father a healer? Now my father needs you. If he lives, we save him. If not, we avenge him. Either way, we fight! <laughs> Truly, you are your father's son. You are right, Rahotep. Demons or not, we will follow you.
Are we ready? We have been ready since the day the demon bandits attacked. We ride to save my father! And may Amun ride with us! Here! You have my spear! Death to Son of Ra's bandits! Death to those who profit from the crocodile stench! Whoa. Rahul! Who is there? What is happening? No more! Please! Who are you? Why are you here? A friend. Can you walk? We need to get you out of here. I don't think so. I can't see. They tortured and blinded me. There is a dock outside of the camp that is safe. Father, you live. What's wrong? The demons have taken my eyes, but they could not take my son. You saved me, Ratap. He saved us all. He slew five of the demons alone. I saw it. Rahotep, you are a man today. You have earned your horse. I can no longer lead. You must lead us now. Father, Bayek of Siwa is also here. He fought with us. You will always be honored at our village. We will make a feast tonight. Will you join us? Your son is brave. I'm glad to have helped him. Though I doubt he will need help in the future. He will lead you well. Now, I must go to hunt my own demons. <laughs> Rahote, what will you do now? Look after my village, and care for my father. He has earned his rest. The leadership is my burden now. And we will hunt down every one of those demon bandits. Not one will be left alive, I swear it. 
We won't stop until the son of Ra's influence is gone from the land. No farm will ever burn again. You are a fine leader, Rahotep. Egypt needs more like you. Running corpses? This is blasphemy. Who did this? Huh? Hey, why are you burning the dead? Don't you fear the gods? Their souls will be forever cursed. I'm sorry to do it, but I have no choice in this. The gods themselves have afflicted us with a pestilence. The dead must be burned to save the living. What pestilence? Is there a plague? Truly, I don't know. Elders have begun falling sick. Children have died clutching their bellies in agony as their parents watch on, lifeless in their beds. This would be cruel, even for the angriest of gods. No one cares about us. Any help would be appreciated. In the Fayum, the poor aren't worth spit. Game on you! I tell you, Relu. My children, your hunger is known. Turn to Sobek for your nourishment. Sobek has provided a way. Though the food is humble, it gives life. Eat with thanksgiving, and trust in He who is pointed of teeth. The Lord of Waters may take our souls. But we will all rejoice in the field of reeds. The splashing one, who came from the great goddess, he who made the herbage green, Lord of the Nile, Dua Sobek. Another dead farmer whose family will now lose their land. They used to eat at the arms kitchen in the market, but soldiers began harassing them. Greek merchants said they were bad for business. There are no signs of a plague on the body. These bowls are filthy. What have the villagers been eating? They must have the food stored somewhere. I should have a look around. Ooh. These arms contain strong seasonings. This food is rancid. It smells like shit. It is completely unfit for eating. This gruel is not fit for rats, let alone people. The strong spices are not for taste. They are disguising the rot. I need to talk with whoever made it. <laughs> Tell me about the food you eat. Where does it come from? A merchant makes it for the poor here. It's not much, but at least it's something. We're thankful. You're welcome to try some. By the gods, no. I do not know how you stomach it. I need to talk to the merchant. Where can I find him? His house is to the south of the town market. I can take you. Let's visit this merchant of yours. I will follow you. May Sobek reward you for helping. <sighs> I've passed many prosperous farms. People here seem to be doing well. Why are there so many poor? Ah, yes. Those are Greek farms. The Greeks pay lower taxes so they prosper. Meanwhile, the Egyptian farmers are slowly forced from their lands. What happens to the land when the farmers leave? Once the owners die, by law the land is freed. If it's good land, the Greeks take it. If not, the desert takes it. Either way, Egyptians are left to starve. Many end up in the slums. Oh, 
Parmichetto? Huh? Yes. Ha'an, wa'an. Ha'an, inna. Make any sejeria. This is the home of the merchant who provides the food. Even the cats here look better fed than the poor. <clears throat> the owner is obviously of substance. Not all Egyptians seem to be equal. Some are just more equal than others. This is awful! No wonder people are falling sick. Who would do this? It is time we met this poisonous merchant. Give him a taste of his own cooking. How may I help you? This is my home. Are you lost? You can explain to me why you have been poisoning the poor. My guess is so you can take their land. It is easier if they are dead. You're referring to the trouble in the slums? Whatever you've heard, I assure you, you misunderstand. I do what I can to help. I have seen your kitchen, merchant. I know what you are doing. And I will see that you are brought to justice. Oh, I see. Well, that changes things. Now, you're trespassing. And I have the right to protect myself. Men! If you are reasonable, I wouldn't have to do this. We could have worked this out. I'm not dying over this. Hold him up. Where are my men? They were just filthy beggars. Why do you care so much about them? No one will miss them. We can talk about this. I'm wealthy. I can pay you. Name your price. You're being unreasonable. Filthy Magi scum. You have no authority here. Who do you think you are? You can't touch me! Help me! Help! Soldiers! Uh. <laughs> this merchant of death was murdering the poor for their land. His love of money was their real sickness. Fayum won't miss him. The dead can rest. There will be no more burning. Be quick! They are selling fast! Unique and valuable treasures from Siwa! I see you bear the markings of old Siwa. Is that a real Magi badge? How much would you sell it for? Siwa is my homeland, and it is not for sale. Everything is for sale here. You should visit Valley Market to the east. They have C1 treasures, not the normal fake stuff. These are real. I would be interested to meet anyone selling genuine C1 treasures. Are you sure you do not want to sell that badge? No matter. Look for the stall under the bird's nest. You will thank me. Did you hear about that new stall with the treasures from the temple in Siwa? From a temple? Are you crazy? You don't want something stolen from a god? Wait. Are they real? Why do you think they are so expensive? I would sell my whole life for an Ankh of Amun. Any Sigiriot? Yeah, yeah. Ah, when an army, a mere heave, a nachte, 
Hürt and Bert. Be said. Shadev nin nebet. Ash sejemes den wenu. Aper chedj keru. How no hürt resse. Shem awesome su. Welcome. We have many unique treasures for sale. Would you like? This is meant to be genuine. But it's a fake. And not a very good one. It is not fake. It is real. Would you like? This is your stall. Yes, mine. Many unique treasures from faraway Siwa. Not fake. Not fake. Have you got anything... Real. I'm sure these are not your best pieces. What do you mean? These are real. Hmm. More expensive ones at my camp. I can take you. Not far from here. You follow. That Magi badge. Not very good, you know. We have better ones. Would you like? I like this one. These are the treasures of yours. Are they fake as well? I told you, not fake. Oh, how did you know? My treasures aren't really real, but not fake. My mother has some real ones anyway. Hey, I have a secret. I was once a Medja in Siwa. I've seen the real treasures. Oh, not fair. I made them all myself, you know. No one else can tell. Hey, do not worry. They are very good fakes. I will not tell anyone. I said, not fake. Were you really Magi? Maybe you are fake. Ah, <laughs> hey. You're a very cheeky child. Hey, let's see what your mother has. We go along the canal. You lead. I will fake it. Does not even make sense. Do not be afraid. Lucky for you, I am real. Stay here and keep hidden. Won't be so nice next time. There's no escaping me twice. Counterfeit treasures are our game. We are the fake bandits here. Give us the money, and we might not kill you. There is no money left. It was all given away. Please, check for yourself. I've got nothing. I must be careful now. I've got a nice sword. Would you like? Who in Hades are you? Take anything you want. As I told them, I do not have any money, but I have many unique treasures from Siwa. Mother, he is not a bandit. He is my friend. Thanks for saving us. I guess you are real. Sorry I said you were fake. He saved us? We have to give him something. We always repay kindness, remember? I've got something. Here. This is a genuine imitation Siwan Kopish. It is very rare. They don't make them anymore. Please, take it with our gratitude. Mother, he already knows. Thank you. I'm honored. Yes, I can tell. This one's really real. There are almost none like it. May you multiply happy years.
Hello again. How are your C1 treasures selling? No, no, no Siwa. Too much trouble. We sell real treasures from Giza now, not fake. Would you like? <laughs> oh, you are still a cheeky child. I should not be seen in this area. This evil boy has profaned the gods. His punishment will be an example and an atonement. His hands for thievery, his tongue for lying. But I'm telling the truth. Silence, boy. You will not speak. Priest, what has the boy done to deserve this? This has nothing to do with you. Back away. The boy will get what he deserves. I serve so bad. I serve so bad. I am a slave. Boy, what are you accused of? I was charged with ferrying two gold sobeks to Crocodilopolis. Just out of port, my ship sank by the lighthouse. I almost drowned. The statues were lost. I didn't steal them. Silence! And you, step back, Sahethi. Wait. Do not threaten me, Neb. I am a Magi. If the boy speaks the truth, I will find your gold sorbex. If he lies, he is yours to deal with. I should check the big Octarim ship. Stealing from a god is the gravest of blasphemy. No punishment is too great for such a transgression. Sorbek is swift to judge the profaners. His many teeth will devour the unworthy. This worthless boy is an example. He's a caution to all those who would blaspheme. Beware! Earthbreakers will have their just reward. No man is above Sobek's law. No priest is beyond retribution. Justice will be done. Let this example instruct you in obedience and faithfulness. This boy's punishment will teach us all piety. Examine your hearts. 
judge yourselves before the gods judge you. Zobek is a healer to those who trust him, but his judgment swift to those who blaspheme. Be vigilant. Pay your offerings. Avoid the fate of this despicable boy. Stealing from a god is the gravest of blasphemy. No punishment is too great for such a transgression. <laughs> It's not to draw attention here. Recent shipwreck. This could be it. A golden statue of Sobek. Beautifully made. Just as the boy said it would be. That last dive was a good haul. The gold Sobek will bring a small fortune. That shipwreck might be hiding more.
A golden statue of Sobek. It is beautiful. The boy tells the truth. I should return these gold Sobeks to that odious priest. No man is above Sobek's law. No priest is beyond retribution. Priest, I have your precious golden Sobek's. Your novice spoke the truth. This useless boy has been constant trouble. Many more punishments await him for his carelessness. Your priest clothing is just a mask for cowardice! The gods I hate masks. This has nothing to do with you, Sahety. Crawl back into your desert hole. I am Medjai, you dishonorable dog. I have the authority here, Medjai. Gods! <laughs> Your authority is removed with your mask, priest. May you walk in the land of the Duat. What do I do now? The temple will not accept me. Sobek has left the fate of this gold with you. You can return to the temple or to your family. The choice is yours. May Sobek be with you. Whatever you do, do it honorably. Egypt needs priests who do not wear masks. Where is it? Where are the benefits? The peace of mind? It is all with the Greeks. It is not for Egyptians. The new laws are made by Greeks for Greeks. Greeks grow fatter and richer in Egypt, while we go hungry. The poor are taxed more than the rich. Why is this happening? This is our home. Egypt belongs to us. Our Fayum, our home, is now a place where there are Greek-only stalls. These naked Iadit will not even serve Egyptians. Prosperity for all? There is no grain. They have burned our farms and driven us out. Where will we get our food? We know what Greek prosperity means. Famine for Egypt. Prosperity for all, they say. Well, where is it? Where are the benefits, the peace of mind? It is all with the Greeks. It is not for Egyptians. The new laws are made by Greeks for Greeks. Greeks grow fatter and richer in Egypt, while we go hungry. 
The poor are taxed more than the rich. Why is this happening? This is our home. This place is heavily guarded. This area is off limits.
Nedjer. In Hemset Herr Awiya. Gehes. Mit das Passop.
Papa, do you think I'll have many children? <laughs> hey, I hope you give your mother and I many grandchildren. I'll have to find a wife then. You are young, my son. There's no reason to rush. I won't rush. But what if I already know? You need to learn how to be a Magi first. Oh, Tawaret. The hippopotamus who walks. Lady of the birth house. She is the goddess of fertility and childbirth. Mistress of the horizon. 
She brings with her the yearly flood of Ard. to get loose! I should be cautious around here. Do I need to deal with you? 
This is heavily guarded.
Papa, why do people die? We are not gods. Everything must die. It is what Amun has ordained for us. Will we be together in the afterlife? Be brave and strong. Fight for justice. Do not lie. This is all anyone can do. Ma'at will decide if we are worthy to walk together in the field of reeds. I'm sure you will though. Your car is good. Pisces, the two fish, joined by the thread of this life, they are forever balanced between the afterlife and the underworld. Hey, you! Stop! <laughs> this place is heavily guarded. attack on site here. Oh, oh, oh. 
Get Sam! Should not be seen in this area. attack on site here.
You can't sleep now. Get up. Sight here. Whoa. Hey. Ah! Magi! Thank <laughs> you. 